here with Adoree Jackson after the Oregon State game. And Adoree, talk about, first of all, that play in the end zone where you had the tip away that Leon came away with the interception. Um, I, I was trying to get in great position. I couldn't set my feet to get the interception, so the first thing I did was try to tip it. And, I mean, Leon was just happened to be there, so I guess you can say it was designed. <laughs> it was a designed play. And then talk about the uh, the defense today. Really good job against Sean Mannion, one of the better quarterbacks in the Pac-12. Yeah, we did a really great job. You know, um, the up front seven, you know, they did good trying to pressure the quarterback and get the ball out quick. And DBs, we did a great job covering. And now that you're four games into your season, how are you feeling right now comfort-wise? Um, I feel good comfortable-wise. Mm -hmm. And then the team right now getting a chance to come back in the Coliseum and a race two weeks ago. How strong was that feeling? That was good. We were just trying to get that bitter taste out of our mouths. And we've been off for two weeks, you know, and we talked about just coming out strong and trying to finish. Here after the USC victory over Oregon State with defensive tackle Antoine Woods. Antoine, a very good day to get against Sean Mannion. What was the key to getting pressure on him? Uh, we just wanted to, uh, you know, we just wanted to go out there and everybody do their assignment and just execute our job. That was the main focus. And this was a guy, obviously, who's one of the better quarterbacks in the Pac-12. You guys are holding him to 120 something yards passing. Very good job done. Yes, we just wanted to make him uncomfortable and make him earn every throw. And what is it about their overall offense that you guys were able to stop? The run game did not get much going either. Yes, we stopped the uh, run game early and forced them to pass, and then we obviously stopped them in the passing game to win a game. And what was the mindset for you guys getting in? Obviously, two weeks you had to sit there and listen to all the talk of the Boston College loss. Had to be good to get out here and do that. Yes, we just wanted to just do our job and everybody focus on their assignment and be assignment perfect in order to execute and win the game.